welcome to my channel. Do you have one of them? All right, this is a 2008, 2008, 2008 Dutch Avenger. Now, if every time you turn your key on, you hear this ticking noise. I mean, the car doesn't even have to be on. It's when you turn the AC on. You're gonna hear a ticking noise. You hear that? All right, so this is what you're gonna do. So, you're gonna open your, you're gonna open your glove box. You're gonna press here in. You're gonna come on the other side, press in. Then the whole box is gonna drop down. You're gonna come up here. And just so you know what you're doing, you're gonna remove, remove the. It's like doing. Remove the filter, the cabin filter cover. So I can just show you, and then we're gonna pull the filter out. So I can show you what we're doing. Okay, once you have that out, then you're gonna see the white cover right there. So you see the white cover? So I'm gonna push. This is what I'm gonna push. I'm gonna push this so that we can get outside air. See, when I push that, I'm gonna push it again. So it close, and that's when the ticking start. <laughs> Excuse me. So, in order to stop that, if you don't want to spend any money on it fixing it, because the right way to fix it would be replacing that little module right there, the little model. But if you don't want to fix it, so what you want to do, you want to make sure you keep that closed. You don't want to keep it right there, see? You don't want to keep that open. So you want to keep that closed. And then we come here on the side. There's a plug right here. Let me show you. There's a plug. There's a plug right there on the side. So you press the tab and pull down. So you press press right here and you pull down now when I push the button nothing happened so we don't really need outside air in my opinion it's better to just keep it closed and I mean you gotta fix you don't need to buy a new one unless you really want to use outside air, which will make the car you know, waste more gas, running hot, and I mean, it's up to you if you want to change it or not. But that's a fix right there. Thank you, and I hope I help someone fix their problem. And just make sure when you unplug it, just make sure it's closed. If you prefer you want it to keep it closed, make sure you when you unplug it, it's closed. If you want to keep it open, just make sure it's open. And then that's it, make sure you put your cabin filter back. And that's it and that's also how you do a cabin filter really easy so let's slide the new filter in the arrow pointing down because the airflow so we're just gonna stick it in here let's turn the key off let's push it in there then we get a little cover Push it on, that's it. Now the draw, you just close it. And it's done. 
See you in the next one.